Welcome, welcome my fellow familiars. I hope you guys are having a great day and hopefully this video doesn't make it any worse because I'm playing werewolves again. I'm sorry about this guys, I just couldn't leave the video at two episodes for werewolves just because I have an OCD. <laughs> okay fine, uh, it's actually insulting to tell two people who actually have OCD. I do not have an OCD, however, I just gotta play it. Just because I don't feel right leaving it at two episodes. At one episode, maybe, but at two episodes, I definitely don't feel right about it, so that's why. Sorry about that guys. Um, anyways, the hand is pretty good. Our opponent might be a control deck. Hmm, we'll see. Now, what do we got here? Nice stuff. So, let's play the forest with the Duskwitch Recruiter. Next turn I'll probably do Mountain with Howl Pack Resurgence. And then Looming Spires. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. And then I might even do Rabbit Bite after I do Looming Spire, so I think that will work out pretty fine. Our opponent does not have anything to play, so we will be swinging at him for 3. He's level 3 with 6, 7 squares. Okay. So there is the Mountain. There is the Howl Pack Resurgence. So now we got a 4-4 four, four on our hands. Excellent. Whoa. Okay, creature spells cost one less to cast, so I will be able to cast silver for Partisan next turn. That's good. We'll do just that. Okay, hmm. So this costs then four mana. So I can do Looming Spire, Silver for Partisan, and follow that up with Cult of the Waxing Moon. Okay. Good. Very, very good. Now, or we'll be even be able to play Sage of the Ancient Lore. Nice, so let's do that here. Let's do the silver fur just in case if our opponent does decide to hit it with something. But I guess he won't. There we go, 5 damage to opponent's face and he drops down to 11. So far he has not played anything, so I guess it's good? Not sure? Guess we'll find out. Okay, there we are. And end the turn. Okay then, now let's see what happens. Okay, opponent has left. Well, that's the first victory, but this is boring deck, so I'm gonna just keep at it. There's Radiant Flames, uh, Silver for Partisan Dice. Uh, okay, we can play Cult of the Waxing Moon, so let's do just that. Mm -hmm. We swing for another 4 points of damage, our opponent drops down to 7. Good, 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 good. Okay then. So next turn I guess we'll play Sage of An Ancient Lore and then follow that up with Kessig Forge Master and Rabbit Bite maybe. Not bad, gotta s whoa, 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 whoa. Okay then. Well then, that's what we'll do here. Now hold on here for a second. Let me rotate. Not bad gets plus two plus two and gains vigilance and haste so let's do that uh, let's give this plus two plus two vigilance and haste I guess okay pretty good there we go and victory okay well that's oh whoa, whoa, whoa. okay uh, spoke too soon there for a second that's not game number one not yet Pawn gains some life but he's at five life total he will be dying next turn, so we should be, oh, come on, well, he's still dying because that's tapped, so, that's good, there we are, let's play that forest, let's play the Sage of Ancient Lore, and should we play Kessig Forge Master? I think we can, so, let's do it, Kessig Forge Master, let's do the Island Hall Special, there we go, and let's swing. Now there's no way opponent's going to be blocking 14 damage to his face. Okay, well, that's game number one. I'll see you guys in game number two. And we're back for game number two. So far so good. Hopefully we get this somewhat over with. I'm sorry if I'm not enjoying this as much, guys. It's just, uh, whoa, level 15. Okay, that's, we're going to be dead. There's no way such a 
deck like Werewolf deck is gonna win against that. And uh, I like this hand, so I'm gonna keep it. The only question here is, I guess we go Looming Spires, Looming Spires, Forest into Bandit. Get the Bandit transformed and then start playing our other creatures. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so Looming Spires, good. Oh boy, this is gonna be interesting. Hopefully we do draw into another land because I don't feel like playing Looming Spires again, but if it comes to that, I'll do it. Okay, let's see what the opponent has. And this has any specials? Nope, no specials. What about this guy? Okay, also no specials. So I'm just making sure I'm not missing anything here. We might be up against the werewolf deck here also. A better version of a werewolf deck just because the one we have definitely sucks. But oh well. Okay. Twin Bolt? Well, he might have Twin Bolt ready. Still going to play the Bandit. Yep, gonna do it. Uh, maybe I should... Nah, I'm gonna play it. If opponent wants to do Twin Bolt, that's fine. So, we'll at least get you swing in for 3 damage. Okay, if he had Twin Bolt, he would have killed us by now. So, this means our opponent does not have a Twin Bolt. Excellent. Let's hope he does not play any spells right now. Please, 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 please. Oh boy, let's see. If this deck wins against level 15 upon, that is quite something. Ah, come on. Well, that was expected. Okay, then we'll go into All Rich Kinder, probably. Or maybe I should do Convicted Killer. Okay, there's the Cinder Glade. Now, let me see. This transforms into 4 4. So, let's go with Convicted Killer. There we are. Awesome. Next turn we'll be able to do Solitary hand Hunter. Good. It's a 3-4, transforms into 5-6. Amazing. There's the Fire Impulse. God damn it. Okay. Well, let's see how he takes care of the Solitary Hunter then. So, let's go. Okay then. Now let's see what happens. 4 damage, he can do maybe a Twin Bolt, or wait, Exquisite Firecraft deals, how much 4 damage, so should have saved up Exquisite Firecraft here, but wow, transformation, that is, I'm not gonna complain, that is wonderful, so Siege of Ancient Lore will get you draw into a card, good, okay, and it's a Looming Spire, so let's swing, confirm, Definitely going to apply Looming Spires to the Sage of Ancient Lore next turn. Wow. Well, the only reason why we're going to win here is just because our opponent has been extremely unlucky. Sage of Ancient Lore transforms. It is going to be a beastly creature right now with 12-12. So uh, that's the end for our opponent. Looming Spires to this guy. There we go. Still going to be 12-12. Wild size. Whoa, thank you so much, buddy. Okay, we beat a level 15 opponent. Well, that's... Come on, what is up with the games here? We just had the luck of the draw, that's all. Okay. Well then, that's game number two. Pretty quick. Let's move on to game number three. And we're back for the last game of this episode. Let's just hope that it's a quick one. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Here we are, level 13, CV245, okay then. And, uh, well that's not a bad hand, I'm gonna keep it. Start off with Fertile Thicket most likely, quickly use its ability. The thing that sucks here is we have no red mana, so playing anything here is gonna be a little bit difficult, that's why I'm going to depend on Fertile Thicket here. Okay. Nice, and we have Arlen Court. So, let's use the special here. Yes. Oh, thank god. Here we go. Okay, so our opponent is 
green white hmm i gotta create a green white deck actually guys uh very curious to see what kind of combinations are possible there so we'll draw into mountain which means i'll play Kessig forge master right away then playing a forest going to play convicted killer another forest will get all in cord out so we should be good let's see what responses our opponent will have here there is that mountain that we needed and Kessig forge master we need one more mountain for breakneck rider and have him transform that would be the best option okay ah uh, well this this special actually trumps this special completely i understand it's trample but come on plus juju and vigilance and haste that's just amazing uh, this is not the greatest this is pretty good right here and this is just absolutely amazing okay so our opponent does play uh citadel castellan that's fine we can we can just kill the citadel castellan no problem right there Ooh, looming spires hmm hmm nope 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 forest convicted killer i want to get our link cord out so that's what we'll do not going to swing let's wait it out okay so if it blocks or becomes block deals one damage to that creature so if our opponent decides to swing with this i can easily block and get it killed no problem that's good let's see grasp oh no he's going to get Kessig block Kessig forge master well even if he does okay i'll just let it through the only problem here is this damn thing has vigilance and it's a uh, renowned too, so it will become a 5-6. 5-6, uh, damn. With vigilance. That's not good. That is not good at all. Okay. Gotta think our options through. Maybe I do not want to play Arlen Core just yet. Maybe I'd like to play Breakneck Rider, that's 4-3. Convicted Killer, that's 4-4. Four, four. So let's get Convicted Killer out, let's skip the blocking here. Yeah, we'll just take the damage, that's fine. There we go, let it become 5-6. Oh boy, it's okay, we'll get it, we'll get it. Now, there's a Lamhold Pacifist. Well, Looming Spires is not much use here. So, let's see. Let's do Convicted Killer. And then what do we do? Well, let's do Convicted Killer, yeah. We'll have to take the 5 damage again, unfortunately. Skip attack and move on. Okay. Uh, so next turn I'll play Lamhold Pacifist with Looming Spires on a Kessig Forge Master. It doesn't matter who I play it on really. There's Evolving Wilds, okay. If no spells are played, we get Werewolves. That puts us in far better position. Let's see what happens. Because I mean, if we got a 4-4, four, four, that's way better. And what does this become? 3-2 and can do 4 damage total, not bad. Okay, our opponent just swings. Uh, he grasp of the hero monster. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care, buddy. Come on. So, if this becomes... Yes, a werewolf. That means it can do 5 damage at once, right? Okay, if it can do 5 damage... No, let's keep blocking. If this can do 5 damage with Looming Spires, it can do 6 damage, thus killing Citadel Castellan. So, I will be swinging with Kessig Forge Master next turn. Okay. That's settled there. There we go. Okay. All of them transform. Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Aha. Uh -huh. It's a 2 3. And becomes 3 5. Can't quite kill that. So. Looming Spires on this. Yes, what are you gonna do? 
he has a wild size maybe that's a possibility actually now that becomes three five right and this becomes four four I think I'd rather have a 4-4, four, four, so let's do that. Let's swing with the Flame Heart Werewolf. Okay, attack phase. There we go, confirm. Next turn I'm going to play the Breakneck Rider. And then try to get everyone transformed. Afterwards I'll follow that up with Arlen Court. With the Breakneck Rider transformed, it means we... Okay, that was very silly on our opponent. What level is he? 13. Oh no! Oh, it becomes a 6-7. No! Ah! Sorry about that, guys. Crap. Well, we lost Kessig Forge Master. That's fine. That is absolutely fine. At least we got all of these now. If our opponent swings this turn, I am going to double block. And get this kill. So, And then I'll get Arlen Cord out. That's probably the best case scenario. Okay. There is another land. And... Opponent attacks. Ooh, does not attack. He realizes that he's at a loss here. Excellent. Okay. Lamphole Pacifist transforms into 4-4. Four, four. Now I can do Breakneck Rider with the Duskwatch Recruiter. Not worth it, I think. Gotta do our link cord here. Let's play her. Let's give her the plus two plus two and vigilance and haste. So we give plus two plus two to Lamphold Butcher. Do we want you? Yeah, why not? Let's do that. It's a six six. We swing and let's see what happens. Oh, this is good. This is real good. Oh, opponent takes that 6 damage to his face, drops down to 14. Okay, not bad. Gotta play Breakneck Rider next, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. So there is the Consul's Lieutenant. There is the Planes. Okay. Okay, definitely going to play Breakneck Rider. We need that so badly. Oh, he played two spells so our werewolves are going to get transformed unfortunately it's a 7-7 seven, seven and 4-2 this thing has a first strike oh oh if he swings with this Do I, okay opponent leaves the game excellent wonderful so they transform it's okay I'm gonna then play Duskwatch Recruiter and Breakneck Rider all in one so let's just do that Breakneck Rider Duskwatch Recruiter Good. Let's just do this even though we're not gonna be swinging with anything really. Yeah, just for the one point gain there. Now, for the special we need six. We're almost there. Uh, let's skip the attack and continue. Okay. Literally almost there. Okay. And it's the turn. Any spells? Yes, there is a spell. There's the rock smallers. 4-4. Four, four. Damn. And trample. Okay, what do we draw into? Howl Pack Resurgence. Uh, I gotta hold out on that. I gotta get them transformed just because of all the stuff that's going on here right now. That's not good. That is not good at all. Okay, let's just do that. Continue and move on. Get them all transformed. Continue. Okay. There's the transformation. All of them. Excellent. There's Kithion's Tactics, which gives it, what, plus two, plus one, okay. All of them, what? Wow. Vigilance, and they gain Vigilance. So, okay, that's a 4-2 with... Uh, okay. Do we just let this through? That's a 6-5. And it's going to become a 6-6 six, six if we let this through. Can't let that happen, so... Get this killed. Yes. Now this guy, 4-2. Gotta do this. Just gotta do it. Okay, 6-5. Can he kill both of them? 
6 damage, right? No, 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 no. Can't let that happen. Let him choose which one he wants to kill. Okay, this way. That's damage. One of these guys is gonna get killed. Uh, yep. That's the way to go, I think. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, uh, this is flush. Let's play it. Nice. Oh, wait. What the hell did I just... Oh. God damn it. Well, okay. More things survived than I expected. That's good. That's very good. That's a 5-6. So if we do... Till end of turn. After one target creature gets this. Then we will play the fertile ticket. Not use the special. Because we got enough lands. So no. Let's play the hunter of the nutter nulls. Okay. Let's attack with everybody. Do we want to do that? Yes we do. Continue. Everybody except this guy. So this branded howler is going to give it plus one plus oh let's do that so all of them will do enough damage confirm okay he blocks that he's dead and we win okay well then that's an episode guys okay thank you so much for watching this and hopefully we never see that decks like this ever again and i'll see you guys in another episode that's going to come out in half an hour bye